Good afternoon, guys. David Hoffman here from David's Bin here, coming at you from beautiful, hot Yaz, Iran, with my boy, Mr. Taster. Hey, how are you guys? They're very good. How are you? <laughs> I'm good. So today we're doing something really special. We're going to see how a few different dishes are made. Yeah, we've got uh, shuri osh, really famous in Yaz. We've got DZ with aubergine or eggplant. We've got quince stew. And it's really famous here. My mom loves it. Mom and Mahin say, "Oi, Mom and Mahin." <laughs> <laughs> One more dishes I can't remember. No worries. Oh, Let's go task inside. Kebab. We've got tusk kebab as well. Tusk kebab? You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> I'm really excited for the eggplant dizzy. That's gonna be so good. Let's go inside. Let's meet the team. Salam, salam. Salam. How are you guys doing, David? Salam, salam. Pleasure. Nice to meet you. What's this? <laughs> <laughs> What's happening here? Look, this is for devil's eye. Okay. It is taken actually to purify the air, the atmosphere, and also bad eyes. So it's the way to welcome the newcomers in Iranian culture. All right. Hello, hello. hello. Wow. Look at this place. Traditional house. Yeah. I love this. Yeah. So what's over there? We got some animals, huh? Yeah. Come. Let's go see that. Ooh. Oh, look at the peacock. Beautiful peacock. You know, I have a bunch of these in my neighborhood. Oh, this guy has this bird. Aww. He's biting, he's biting. Look at the peacock. Okay. All right. Enough with the birds. <laughs> so, this is a traditional home, huh? I mean, this is incredible. Look, you have a garden over here to the right. You have the birds. You have this little relaxing area. You can probably smoke some shisha here. Over here, we have a fountain. Wow. This is so beautiful. Oh, rose water. Mosquito. Oh, with Mosquito. Yeah. Oh, that is nice. Mmm, so tasty. So it's not rose water. No, no, no. Oh, but very refreshing. Must willow. It's going to give you another another cup. Yeah. Let's have some more. In this city, you have to stay hydrated. Oh wow! I love it. That was so good. You ready for the food? Mm, yeah. I'm ready for the food. Abush means dizzy uh, with origin or eggplant. So we've got meat, lamb, we've got uh, tomato, we've got potato, onion, and chickpeas, uh, turmeric, salt, and pepper. That's it. That's it for that dish? It? Oh, it sounds amazing. Yeah. Some water. Chickpeas. Lamb with fat. This city is all about the lamb, huh? Yeah. <laughs> this country is about <laughs> So how long is that? 10 minutes. So it's going to boil for 10 minutes? Yeah. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> yeah. They normally put the water water like that, so it's getting cold in the hot oh, yeah? water. Yeah. <laughs> she's been boiling that pot for 10 minutes, now she's going to add some spices. She just added turmeric? Yeah. So like pepper? So it's gonna take like two hours to get the dizzy or up push ready. So now we're gonna go for Queen's stew. Really famous here. So you've got lamb, a split peas, pomegranate sauce, and apricot. Okay, let's try this apricot. Apricot. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice and sticky. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Nice and meaty. Mm, love it. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, next up, she's gonna add some turmeric. Turmeric, yeah. Love it, looks amazing. Smells great. Yeah. <laughs> the turmeric hitting the onions, yeah. the lamb. And how long is this gonna cook for? For a while, uh, right? Two, two, three minutes. Oh, quick. Yeah. Quince. Split peas. Split peas, yeah. Oh my gosh, we're boiling here, they have to cover us with something. <laughs> now we're going to add the apricot to the quince stew. So what do we do next? Uh, we're making coffee for you. 
coffee, um, we call it Kahve Yazdi. It's really old and it's been a uh, national registration. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh wow, it smells amazing. Yeah, it's a, a little bit sweet, different mm -hmm. from the coffee you had before. Yeah, it's gonna be sweet. Yeah. So we started a fire here for the coffee. Between the fire and the sun, it's intense. Oof, look at that. Oh my god, it's like a thousand degrees here, man. Like, I'm already sweating. So this is where we're making coffee, right here. Nice. We get out of the sun. We've got tusk kebab here, which is lamb, potato, tomato, and lemon. You ready? I'm ready. I can't wait for this one. This is unique to this city, right? This is to this city? Yeah, for this city. Okay. So turmeric and black pepper. We're cooling down this little tent we made here on the side because it's so hot right now. It's musk willow. Oh, that's good. The water is boiled. Now it's time to make some coffee. Yeah. All right. We're gonna put cocoa, uh, cardamom, sugar, sugar cube, and coffee. Perfect. Rose water and cardamom going after. Rose water and coffee and cardamom? Dude, it's gonna be sweet. Yeah. It's gonna be a sweet coffee. Yeah. Uh, normally it takes seven, eight hours, but we're gonna do it in two hours only. But any more uh, time, it would be much more delicious. So they're gonna add potatoes and tomatoes to the tusk kebab. Yeah. David, it's a local bread of uh, Mehriz, the area name. It's called Mehriz. Yeah. They're just making it in this area. And they put it in tanur. Yeah. Tandoor, tanur, same thing, clay yeah. oven. Yeah, yeah. Wow, this is amazing. And they mix it with some herbs, look yeah. at that. So he's lighting a fire and he's dropping it into the tanur. It's getting really hot in two seconds. Oh, it's a fast fire, look at that. Oh my gosh, that fire is raging. The fire is intense, look at that. It's like cooking the wall. Look at the wall. <laughs> the wall's on fire. <laughs> right there on a little pillow. And then he's gonna go in and throw it in. Very similar to how they do it in India and Pakistan, a lot of places around the world where they use a the tandoor, right? Basically South Asia, Central Asia, Middle East, they do this. Tandoor, tandoor. They put bread on a pillow, they put it on the wall, it cooks up in literally two minutes, three minutes, it's done. This bread looks phenomenal. Oh, and we have water, yes Very of nice. course. All right guys, it's my turn. I've done it before, I've done this in India. Let, let me see where it is, let's see. How deep is it? Oh my God, it's deep, it's deep. Okay, so you gotta be really careful. Not so good. I tried. Uh, okay. Just I tried, I tried. Oh, he's making it nice and charred. Look at that, crispy. Mm -hmm. This is really amazing, guys, look at this. He keeps moving it onto the stone, taking it off, seeing if it's enough charred on it. Like if it's enough, you know, crispiness. Ooh, it's hot, it's so hot. Careful, you're gonna burn your hand. So luckily for us, we can taste it right away. Ooh, hot. Mmm. Coriander. Mmm, nice and fluffy. Oh, wow. Um, it's so good. Mm -hmm. It's so good. You know, it is too good. Mm -hmm. Wow, one of the best ever. Mm -hmm. Sesame seeds, mm. coriander. We are making a shuli ash, and it's must have in Yaz. It's really famous, exactly like, uh, what was the name of this? Oh, like borscht. Yeah, borscht in Russia. If you go to Russia, you must have borscht. And here is shuli. Very strange, because their beetroot is white. It's very different from the one I've had in Ukraine. Slava Ukraini. So after two hours of boiling that coffee, it's time to add cardamom and rose water. Ten minutes. <laughs> Only ten minutes? Yeah. It's been a long day. Yeah, it's been We've a long been in the day. fire the whole day. <laughs> <laughs> so what is he doing there? He put the coal in it. 
<laughs> to take the bitter taste out. Yeah? Yeah. I've never seen this before in my life. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. It's my first time as well. This is almost ready, so we're gonna add some tomato, potato, and onion. Yeah. Long process. Yeah. And eggplant. Wow. More water? Wow, what a dish, huh? Uh. The coffee's ready. I'm super excited to try this. It's gonna be amazing. It's already like 4.30 in the afternoon. We're gonna pair this with Yazdi cake. Or cake Yazdi. Cake Yazdi and coffee from here. So let's have the cake first. Okay. Mmm. 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 Carbon. I don't have the coffee. Mm-hmm. Oh, what a pairing. Mmm. Mm. Take a seat. Mm-hmm. Take a seat. Mm-hmm. The best coffee I've ever had in my life. Really? The rose, the cardamom. Mmm. So it's our uh, queen's stew and she's gonna put uh, pomegranate uh, paste in it and also saffron. The smell, that aroma. Wow, can't wait for this. Two hours in the making, huh? Now saffron. So there's wheat powder for the... For the arsh. For the arsh. arsh. And that's it? Yazi surely, yeah. like borscht, but this is green. <laughs> this is amazing. She added onion with mint. Oh yeah. She fried it, yeah. Oh okay, she okay. Fried it in the kitchen, and then she added to the basically like soup. sautéed it. Exactly. And then now she's gonna add some vinegar. Yeah. Smells nice, huh? It smells amazing. This is the quince stew. <laughs> Guys, you have no idea. The aroma coming out of this pot. Whoa, never smelled something like this before. The turmeric, nice and bright yellow. Vibrant colors here. On oh, the chickpeas too. Can't wait, can't <laughs> wait. So I thought that was it, but no. There's still another piece of this process. Yeah. He has to mash it. He has to mash the, the same as this we had in Tehran. We have to mash it. Fight for the... For the bone marrow? Yeah. So we're not fighting today? So no, no, I've got one more. Oh, you got one more? Yeah. All right, at least we're starting with something good. <laughs> yeah. We haven't eaten yet. Yeah, look at the pickle face. She's waiting you want to You want it? I take it? Okay, okay. You ready? Yeah, cheers. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Ah. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh. Mm. Oh, meat and the fat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. That was good. You guys have no idea. This is gonna blow our minds right here. So we still have one more to serve. Yeah. Lunch, actually, liner is served. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so how do we start this? So this is Shuli Osh, really famous in Yaz. Uh, they added saffron and vinegar at last. This one is Tusk kebab, tomato, potato and lamb. Mm -hmm. And this one is the meat juice. It's the meat juice? The abgusht, yeah, with aubergine in it. And this one is um, quince. Quince. Quince stew. So it's got quince in it, lamb and chickpeas. And then we also mashed it, right? Oh, we have the mash as well which we call it Gusht Kubide. And the bread, oh, oh, I love it, I love it. Let's start with the ash. And as you can see, sugar beets here are white. Oh, the beer is white? Yeah. So it's pomegranate paste, you put it on shuli ash, like that. Mm-hmm, mm. 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 Very similar to borscht. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's just like nice and green yeah, now. And um, borscht is red. Mm -hmm. It's also nice and sweet because yeah. of the pomegranate paste. Mmm. Oh. It's amazing. Oh, wow. It's so good. I love it because so rich. The beetroot. Mm. Nice and crunchy, right? Mmm. 
Absolutely love it. Oh, and it's so hot. <laughs> Still nice and hot. Mm. Right. It's very good. This is different though. It's not the same yeah. as borscht. No. I think adding that sweet element, pomegranate, mm. nice twist. Yeah. That's it? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. So this is crispy bread. We put it in the bowl again, like that. And then we're so, gonna go for eggplant meat juice. So I'll put some potato for you. More meat juice, some meat on top. So the bread basically soaks it up and it becomes soft. We've got aubergine and tomato <laughs> top on top. And a bit more. Mm. 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 Oh, I love it. Oh, that's good. Mm. The bread was hard and now it's so yeah. soft. Oh, wow. Um, that lamb. Yeah. <laughs> it melts. You got a lot of lamb. I got nothing. <laughs> I'm joking. It's my lamb. <laughs> oh, like that. Like the object. Oh, my God. No more lamb. Yeah, for you. I'll get a piece of lamb from you. Look at that piece of lamb right there. You can have both. Mmm. 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 Nice. Oh my god. <laughs> the moisture popped me out of the lamb, soaked it all up, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow. And the aubergine. I love the aubergine. What a meal. Mm hmm. So different, huh? Yeah. We haven't had this dish. Ready for the next one? <laughs> <We're done. laughs> this is taddy with potato. Upside down rice with potato, yeah. so nice and crispy. Ooh, wow. Yes. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know. Mmm. I love this work. Wow. If, if you're gonna kill Iranian, just close her, his hand or her mm. hand and just have Ty dig in front of him. <laughs> Seriously. It's so soft. Mm. 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 Amazing. Mm. Delicious. Crispy rice, soft, hard, crunchy. Exactly. So they're putting underneath when they're gonna put the rice. So rice on top and then upside down and the Ty dig is coming out. Amazing. So saffron rice as always. You guys love your saffron rice. Yes. Love the saffron rice, yeah. but the amount of butter they put. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. Queen's stew. <laughs> Only in gas. Oh. Mm. Mm. Oh. Wow, sweet. Sweet and nice. Mm-hmm. Mm. Everything pairs well with each other. It's like a nice balance. And you have to have it with rice. Yeah. Because that rice soaks up that like gravy, right? So nice. And Iranian can't live without rice. Mm-hmm. I know. Mm. And here in Iran, they love the rice. Oh. I feel like it's like, a, like an Oman. Without rice, there's no meal. Yeah. Right? Mm. Mm. This is amazing. Wow. Amazing. Nice one. Tusk kebab. My mom loves it. Look at the color. Look. Crazy. Okay, bring the bread. The bread. Do we need bread? I think we yes. need bread. Look at this monster. Okay. Take a bit. Okay. And put lamb. Lamb on top? Yeah. Or inside, right? Ooh, it's still very hot. Let it soak up. Some potato. Mm hmm. Tomato. Like that. Mm hmm. And some juice on top. Ready. Ready? Oh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Amazing. Mm hmm. Another sweet dish. Cinnamon. Cinnamon, yeah. Tomato paste. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. 
the lamb. Mm. It gets better and better with the lamb, yeah? Yeah. Wow. This is that broth right there, that soup. I'll be sure. Mm. 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 Oh. I think this is the best lamb of all the dishes. Yeah. And let's have the juice. This is juice alone. Mmm. Oh man. Mm. It actually reminds me of gazpacho. Gazpacho? Mm hmm. Spanish, uh, Spanish. Spanish um, huh? Yes, yeah, it's, it's basically the same thing. It's tomato. Do you want tomato tissue? soup? Yes, sir. So we still have one more dish to try, and it's the mash, it's right? Kushkubide, yeah. Kushkubide. 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 Yeah. Means mash meat. Mash meat. We had the juice. Mm hmm. Now it's time to have the kushkubide. And for that, we need onions. Okay, what do we do with the onions? But we have to break it with our hands. Ready? Is that okay? Yeah, I can. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Uh, you broke it? Oh. Oh. Look at that. Mine is better. Mine? I'm experienced, man. <laughs> I'm Iranian. <laughs> Bring the bread. Bring the bread? Yeah. You need more bread? <laughs> <laughs> we believe that this would be more delicious. Okay. Because the gas is coming out, oh. so it would be sweeter. So it's like basically airing out. At exactly. This point. Yeah. Okay. You ready? Yeah. So what do we do? Just go in here. <laughs> He's not hang hungry anymore. Look at my boy. I'm, I'm not hungry Look anymore. <laughs> I'm full. <laughs> I'm eating a lot here. Okay. And then, for you? Okay. And for me. Oh, you should put it inside? You can put it inside or you can have it after. Ready. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Mm. 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 So delicious. Oh yeah, but that onion is strong. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh my God. What a finish. <laughs> what a finish. Mm -hmm. Well, that was our experience mm. here. Yeah. What's the name of this hotel? Saroye Jahan Gard. And that's the hotel, right? Mehriz, yeah. Mehriz. Near Yazd. Yeah, like a 20 minute drive. 20 minutes from Yazd. Yeah, we saw a whole process of how you make all these dishes. We spent like six hours here yeah. going through every single one. What an experience. I loved it all. I mean, this is just phenomenal. Yeah. Each dish is completely different, all from Yazd. Mm. Well, one in specific, this one, is the one that's really from here, right? Like, this is yeah. only here. Thank you so much to Kutuk Travel yeah. for bringing us here. Mr. Chaser, thank you so much. Thank you. Guys, subscribe to him. Follow my channel. <laughs> Thumbs up, comment below. We'll see you in the next one. Maybe in Yaz, maybe in Shiraz. Maybe in Miami. Maybe in Miami. <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm going to eat some more of this, but alone. Mmm. That's good. All right, I need a bed. I need a bed. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no,